In this video, I'm going to show how to upload photos and videos with Make automatically to Pinterest. Photos you can upload with built-in module, but for videos, we have to go around. In the first half, I'm going to show photos. So first, I'm going to add Pinterest module, create a pin. And let's make a new connection. Save. And give access. For source type, I'm going to use image URL. I have tried many times to try to upload video with this method, but it's not working. As you can see, you can also choose multiple image URLs. Right now, I'm choosing only one. For image URL, you have to have downloadable URL. I am using AI, so I'm going to use URL that is given me by AI. But you also can use something from Google Drive or Microsoft Drive, when you can download the image. For the board, I don't have right now anything. So I'm going gonna go back to Pinterest, create a new pin. And publish. So now when I refresh, I have my board. And that's basically it, you just now fill up everything you have, I'm just gonna have AI generated title also with the description and that's basically it you can fill up anything you like or you don't like so the image one is pretty simple let's run this test one time and let's see how it does as you can see AI is generating the image also a text and now it has been successfully uploaded let's check Pinterest and as you can see it's generated the image put it in the Egypt board, here is the image, and here is the text. So this is the version how to upload photos to Pinterest with built-in module. And the next one I'm going to show you is to how to upload videos. It is a similar way like I showed in my previous videos with TikTok and now also with X. As with updated version, you can't anymore upload to X or Twitter in Make. So for that, I'm going to use Buffer. But as you can see, you can't upload straight away to Buffer from the Make. So for that, I'm going to use Zapier. So first, to upload video to Pinterest, you are going to need a module for a Google Sheet or in my case, Microsoft Excel. So I'm going to go to my OneDrive or Google Drive and create a new workbook. I'm going to rename it and add a couple of titles. First one and most important one is video URL and the second one is video title. If you want, you can add more like video description. So now I can return to make, add Microsoft Excel in my case and search for add a worksheet row. I'm going to click on it. I already have a connection, so I'm just going to search for the workbook Pinterest videos and select worksheet one. For values is values only. And for video URL, I'm going to choose downloadable URL. If you're using AI, then AI will give you this video URL. And for video title, I'm going to use AI generated title. Click Save and let's run this scenario. So it will fill up this sheet. As you can see, in this scenario, I have many sleep modules, three to be exactly, and one sleep module is five minutes. And it is because Zapier, that I'm going to show later, is taking 15 minutes to check for the new apps in a free version. So to avoid deleting video before it is uploaded through Zapier to Buffer and from there to Pinterest, I added this total of 15 minutes delay. I recommend also doing it because otherwise video will be deleted before it even reaches TikTok, Pinterest or X. But for now, I'm only going to run new workbook. So when I go back now to workbook, I can see here is the video URL and here is also video title. So the next thing you're going to need is buffer account. If you have seen my previous videos, then you have seen that I have connected TikTok and X already. So next one is Pinterest. Let's make a connection. And let's give it access. Here is one important thing you have to do in order to it to work is that you have to manually create a new post. And this is necessary because you have to create a new 
board. Somehow, otherwise it gives me an error. So I'm gonna create a new board, choose this one, add title, and instead add of queue, press share now. And we'll now upload this video to Pinterest. So it now has uploaded, it took some time. And as you can see, here are the previous photo, and uh, one photo I tried before, and here is the video that is sent. Let's go now to Pinterest, refresh it. And as you can see, video is being processed. So now video is added. For some reason, it only works if you create a new board with the buffer. So now I can go to Zapier. I already have account, create a new Zap. In free version of Zapier, you can make only two step Zaps, which is enough for us. First one, what I'm gonna need is Microsoft Excel or Google Sheet if you're using Google. Here I'm gonna need new row, which is triggers when a new row is added, which is what just happened, what we just didn't make, and select account, create a new connection, or as I already have a connection, then continue. In the next step, I'm gonna choose spreadsheet, which is in my case, Pinterest videos, and the worksheet. Continue, and let's test trigger. Now it found us a new row, as you can here see, it is a video URL and video title. And let's continue with selected record. And let's now take buffer. For buffer, action is add to queue account. As I already have connection, I'm just going to choose my account. And continue. By default, the organization is my organization. Tags, I don't need. Channel is, as you can see now, Pinterest. For the text, I'm gonna use video title. For the media, I choose video. And now for the video, I'm gonna choose video URL. And now, as you can see, it has this Pinterest channel that I just created in Buffer. Let's click this one. It asks for the title. It is same as with this video title. I have video title and video text same, but as I said, you can generate it differently. And for the method, this time it is share now. Continue. And let's test step. It's going to take some time and might even give us an error. Yes, it gave an error, but it actually gives me every time when I do it. So, but when I go to buffer and refresh it, then you can see sent is now four and this video is just added 17 seconds ago. So now back in buffer, you can just skip the test and publish. I'm also gonna rename it. But as you can see, with this method, you can also upload images. But if you're only uploading images, then I think it's easier with built-in Pinterest module, but it is also possible here. You just take instead of videos image and feed this workbook image URL and image title. So this is how you build it in Buffer and Zapier. And as I told before, it is recommended to add these sleep modules before deleting. If you don't know how to build module like this, when it automatically uploads to every social media, then you should watch my previous videos. I'm also going to make a video how to create images with XAI so you don't have to do them manually. Have a great day.